Yeah, so this year, a friend and I completed a couple of ultras earlier in the year. Uh, cheeky little 45 miler in January, way back in January, which we're doing again next year. That's coming up in five weeks. Scary to think. Uh, but it's going to be good. Done it twice now. Uh, great little race down in Buckinghamshire into London. Uh, yeah, and then we also ventured in April up to Yorkshire for uh, an interesting one. Uh, nice 62 miles, uh, although, although only another 15 20 miles longer than the 45. Um, totally different race. Uh, up over the hills, up, down, up, down, up, down. Uh, pretty mental. Took 27 and a half hours that one. Um, but we, we finished it. Last one's to finish it, but we finished it. Survived, to tell the tale. Uh, so we're looking forward to doing that one again um, next year. So must get the entry in for that one though. So I'm pretty sure that'll book up soon. So um, yeah, so as well as that, looking to do a 130 miles September, August, September time. That's a stage one, that's a three day, three day race, so 30 miles, 60 miles, 30 miles, and a few here and there. Um, so that's going to be a totally different challenge to what we're used to, um, as it's over three days rather than just in one fell swoop. So I'm not sure how that one's going to go, but starting to sweat about that. Uh, and also got our entry in for our 95 miler non stop up in Scotland, back in my homeland. Um, so I've got ballot in, in the ballot for that, and we'll find out in the next few days by email whether we get in for that one or not. Um, but that would be brutal, brutal. Can't, can't wait for that one. Um, going back up to the homeland, um, 95 miles non-stop. That's, that's going to test the metal. So, uh, yeah, better keep going and get some training in. I'll speak to you shortly.